A very good morning, my dear children. Children, today's English verb we will do in our workbook activity book cursive zero. So take out your workbook. If you have taken out all the things, just open your book to page number forty-two and forty-three. This is page number forty-two and this is forty-three. So today we are going to do these two pages. Okay, children, you know we all are Indians, and our Republic Day is about to come. As an Indian, we should be aware of our national symbols and our national flag. So we are going to read and write about the national symbols in this lesson. Let's start today's work. Firstly, you will write down date here. You will write down the date twenty second. Dot zero one dot twenty. Okay. And after writing the date, we will read the first sentence, and that is. L O T U S Lotus I S is O U R R N A T I O N A L National F L O W E R Flower Full Stop. So Lotus is our national flower. What is the name of our national flower? Lotus. So let's start tracing. L O T U S Lotus I S is O U R R N A T I O N A L National Flower and we will repeat the same sentence in Next row. L O T U S Lotus I S is O U R R N A T I O N A L National. F L O W E R flower lotus is our national flower now come to the next sentence and here you will read peacock is our national bird so start tracing p e a c o c k peacock is r national bird so children in this lesson you are learning about our national symbols okay p e a c o c k peacock is a national bird national bird now our next sentence is tiger is our national animal so start tracing T I G E R tiger I S is O U R R N A T I O N A L national A N I M A L animal tiger is our national animal and we will repeat the same sentence in next row T I G E R tiger is R N A T I O N A L 
नेशनल ए एन आई एम एल एनिमल सो वी हैव रिपीटेड द सेम सेंटेंस इन नेक्स्ट रो ऑल्सो नाउ रीड द नेक्स्ट सेंटेंस द लाइन कैपिटल इज आर नेशनल एम्बलम ओके सो स्टार्ट रेसिंग टी एच ई द एल आई ओ एन लाइन सी ए पी आई टी ए एल कैपिटल इज ओ यू आर आर एन ए टी आई ओ एन एल नेशनल एम्बलम ई एम बी एल ई एम द लाइन कैपिटल इज आर नेशनल एम्बलम सो वी विल रिपीट द सेम सेंटेंस इन नेक्स्ट रो टी एच ई द एल आई ओ एन लाइन C A P I T A L capital is R N A T I O N A L national E M B L E M emblem. The land capital is our national emblem. Read the last sentence of this page. Jangar Man is our national anthem. Everyone knows that. You know that now. Start tracing. Capital J, A, N, A, Jana, Gana, G A N A, Gana, M, A. एन ए मन जनगण मन इज आर नेशनल एंथम ए एन टी एच ई एम फुल स्टॉप we will repeat the same sentence in next row jana gana mana is r national anthem a n t h e m national anthem okay so children we have read and written few sentences uh, about our national symbols lotus is our national flower peacock is our national bird tiger is our national animal the lion capital is our national emblem jangan man is our national anthem come to the next page children in this page we can see our tricolor national flag our national flag is in three colors saffron white and green saffron stands for sacrifice white stands for peace and green stands for prosperity fine let's read and write the sentences here firstly you will trace first sentence tricolor is our national flag so we will trace it here t r i c o l o u r tricolor i s is o u r r n a t i t i o n a l national f l L A G flag 
ट्राई कलर इज आर नेशनल फ्लैग चिल्ड्रन लास्ट सैटरडे इन एक्टिविटी क्लास यू हैव लर्न हाउ टू मेक आर नेशनल फ्लैग सो हेयर वी आर रीडिंग एंड राइटिंग अबाउट ट्राई कलर फ्लैग टी आर आई सी ओ एल ओ यू आर ट्राई कलर आई एस इज ओ यू आर आर एन ए टी आई ओ एन ए एल नेशनल एफ एल ए जी फ्लैग ट्राई कलर इज आर नेशनल फ्लैग कम टू द नेक्स्ट सेंटेंस इट हैज थ्री कलर्स एज ए टोल्ड यू एंड यू कैन सी हेयर ऑल्सो आई टी एट एच ए एस हैज टी एच आर डबल ई थ्री सी ओ एल ओ यू आर एस कलर्स ओके कम टू द नेक्स्ट सेंटेंस सेफ्रिन स्टैंड फॉर सेक्रीफाइस येस Firstly, you will trace it here. S E F F R O N saffron. S T A N D S stands F O R for S A C R I. Secre, F I C E F I S E S A C R I F I C E sacrifice. Full stop. The same sentence you will write in next row. Start writing. S A F F R O N saffron. S T A N D S stands. F O R for S A C R I F I C E sacrifice. Saffron stands for sacrifice. Now, children, come to the last sentence of this exercise. Start tracing first. White stands for peace. W H I T E white s t a n d s stands f o r for p e a c e peace white stands for peace we will repeat the same sentence in next row w h i t e white S T A N D S stands F O R for P E A C E peace. So, children, we have completed these two exercises in our workbook, activity book, cursive zero. in the same way you will read this lesson about national symbols and our national flag okay thank you bye bye